What's up guys, thanks for Yankee here. For this week's video, we're gonna be doing the fourth installment of Japanese snack tasting. Anyhow, let's dive into this. First up, we have caramel, it just says caramel corn on it. I'm assuming this is caramel popcorn, although they kind of look like Cheetos. I don't know if you can kind of see that, but they're a little bit like Cheetos, so. Yeah. Not bad. Like a caramel corn Cheeto. <laughs> so, but not too bad. And these are not stale. Right, next one, this one right here. And these are barbecued flavored scones. Which last time I checked, a scone was a biscuit looking thing. These don't look anything like biscuits, but that does not look appealing. It's like a deformed, dirty Cheeto you just picked up off the floor. I guess. Oh, I don't know what kind of barbecue flavor that is, but that is not barbecue. Oh my god, no, 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 no. Mm -mm. That is nasty. All right, next one is this one. It's like a Hello Kitty thing. Um, don't know what it is. Looks like little, maybe little cereal things. This could be a bag of anthrax, but a ball form. I guess we're about to find out. It tastes like anything. I don't know, does anthrax have a taste to it? <laughs> I guess they're like very, very lightly sugared. Or lightly covered with anthrax. I don't know what the hell those were. There wasn't, there wasn't a description in this book, so. Alright, next up is this tubey looking thing right here. It's supposed to be onion, tomato, and spinach. They look like little, I guess, mini rice cakes. Let's see. I'm, I don't know what color that is. Uh, I think that was the onion room. Ew. See this tomato. It's like, it's like, I guess the onion was kind of like a Funyun, but there was no fun in that yun. That was way too oniony. And the tomato one just tasted like dry ass tomato. Ew. All right, there's the next one right here. And this is Takoaka. I don't know, it's supposed to be some sort of strawberry candy. Not bad. Basically, the outside's got a strawberry coating on it, and the inside's like a like a chocolate powder. Mm. Not bad. This looks like again better than the vegetable disc over here that they try to make me eat. Right, this is the next one. And according to the description, it's an old grape gummy, old grape flavored gummy. Huh. Looks like a cat, a cat's paw. Let's see. That's my chewy. Kind of tastes like grape. Kind of tastes more like a berry. Like a blueberry. I don't know. Apparently cat, cat uh, paw tastes like grapes. So, there you go. I guess that's why they're always licking themselves. I guess they taste like grape. There you go. Now we know why. Mystery salt. Okay, these are the next ones here. Cherry of some sort, I don't know. Kinda of looks like white chocolate. Let's hope that's what it is. Not compressed anthrax. Oh my god, I feel a chewy center. What the hell? I was not expecting that. Oh my god, what is that? God, it's disgusting. It's like I just licked the floor. What the hell did I just eat? These robust and luxury candies are made inspired in the shape of the Italian panna cotta dish. Enjoy a hint of floral sakura blossom flavor mixed with cherry to give you the true Japanese feeling of spring. Well, apparently spring to them involves licking a floor. Ugh. That was so grainy. That is disgusting. Oh my god. That was not chocolate. Here's the next one. And this is supposed to be a combination of honey and kumquat. What the hell is a kumquat? Very chewy. Here's the honey. 
Yeah, well, that's kumquat. Kum, kumquat. 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 Whatever. I guess I want you. So, yeah. Not bad. This is better than the floor. The floor chews I had a second ago. Next one is Hello Kitty Biscuit Stick. Yeah, it's pocky. Strawberry flavor pocky. I love pocky. And this is basically pocky, so I love this. But yes, Hello Kitty makes a good biscuit stick. This is the next one. And uh, according to the description, this is supposed to be blonde chocolate, which in some ways white chocolate. Apparently they don't use white over there, they use blonde, but whatever. This actually better taste like chocolate than I like that other thing. Oh, okay, it's like a, there's a piece of chocolate. Oops, we can see it. Chocolate there, and then there's like a little biscuit on the back. I don't know, we'll see, let's see. Not bad. I think it tastes a lot better without the biscuit on it, though. This kind of makes it dry. Next one here. This is uh, supposed to be strawberry cotton candy. Looks like a big old pillow. Just take a nap on it, and then when you wake up, you can eat it. I love cotton candy. Oh, yeah. It doesn't melt right in your mouth. That's good quality cotton candy. Mm hmm. Oh, yeah. Oh, good. But seriously, what is it with all the strawberry flavored everything? Is that all they have in Japan is strawberries? Like everything I taste like is with strawberries. What the hell? That's one up as a drink. And this is a uh, melon cream soda. Bottoms up. Okay. Definitely taste the melon. It's good. Thank God. <laughs> Um, yeah, basically, if you've ever eaten cantaloupe, basically what it tastes like, cantaloupe, cantaloupe, carbonated, so not bad. So that's pretty much it for this video, um, so yeah, all right, so you guys like that video, give it a thumbs up, uh, subscribe if you're new, comment anything below you'd like to comment. I'm Texas Yankee, this is the Texas Yankee and King Casper channel, and I'm out of here. I had nothing to say, and I'd get lost in the nothingness inside of me. I was confused.